There is an increased impetus to healthcare research because of its importance to individuals and governments and its growing cost to the economies. My research focuses on telemedicine, which involves delivering diagnosis and patient care using information and communication technology. In India, about 70% of the population lives in rural areas, while 75% of the doctors and healthcare facilities are concentrated in urban areas. The scenario is not very different globally. Telemedicine can potentially address these healthcare disparities. The benefits of telemedicine include improved access to high quality care and reduced costs. Telemedicine, which relies on ICT, has been practiced and researched for over two decades. However, the advances in ICT and health information technology such as mobile computing, Internet of Things, health wearables, portable medical equipment, and longitudinal health record systems have resulted in new telemedicine designs. Patient remote monitoring is a recent form of telemedicine for 24 by 7 in-house monitoring of patients' health. Healthcare professionals provide immediate care to patients at their homes in case of discrepancy in the health parameters. These telemedicine designs have created a new paradigm with the doctor or the hospital coming to the patient's home rather than the patient going to the hospital or the doctor, therefore transforming the place of care. New actors such as healthcare workers, nurses and medical technicians play a crucial role in these new telemedicine designs. Telemedicine is no longer a monolithic system used on hospital premises for physician to physician interactions. It therefore requires newer theoretical lenses for telemedicine research. Although telemedicine has high potential in addressing healthcare challenges, it is also very complex to use because of the diverse human and technology actors and their interactions. Social factors like low ICT skills, low health literacy and lack of infrastructure, which are largely prevalent in the developing countries, further magnify the complexity of telemedicine use. This heightened complexity forces users to engage in adaptations during the system use. As an example of adaptation, physicians can use personal messaging applications like WhatsApp to communicate with patients instead of the hospital authorized applications. Adaptations like these are a double-edged sword with both positive and negative consequences for individuals as well as organizations. My thesis aims to study the user's adaptations of the telemedicine system and how these adaptations influence the care practices. Unlike face-to-face -face clinical encounters, teleconsultations involve disembodied and digitized interactions with no direct interactions between the patient and the physician. Physicians have to rely on limited senses such as seeing and hearing mediated through video and audio consultation features of the telemedicine system. My research focuses on the care provider's adaptations during the diagnosis process and how they address the challenges of limited sensory engagement options available in telemedicine. I study the research questions using the adaptive structuration theory and affordances theory. This thesis contributes to the literature on technology in use practices and the effective use of remote service applications like telemedicine. Thank you.